everyone and welcome to Lisa and Will's Halls. I have an exciting Dollar Tree haul to share with you today and I'm going to start with my most favorite item of this haul and yes it is a food item. A couple weeks ago Will and I went to Dollar Tree and while we were in Dollar Tree he had brought a couple bags of these up to the cart and I was like, nah, let's don't try them because I have tried other wafers at Dollar Tree and they were really dry. So I was like, let's just, you know, put them back. And I watched a haul a couple nights ago and I cannot for the life of me remember who it was. They had a live haul and she was saying that these were delicious and that they were really creamy on the inside. So that piqued my curiosity. So today, when I was out Dollar Tree shopping, I had to find them. Oh, I went to five stores, I believe, today, and only two had them, and I did get five bags of these, and one was almost eight by the time we arrived home. These are delicious. If you run across these, don't be like I was and pass them by. But they are the premium wafers of bite size with vanilla cream, artificially flavored, light and delicious. They are in the 7.5 ounce size. Oh, these are so good. Um, they are made in Turkey and they are out of a company in Salem, New Hampshire. But I think this is my most favorite thing as far as uh, sweet treats at Dollar Tree that I have ever bought. My son was with me today. It was just he and I. And he loves this peanut brittle. And it is in the five ounce. And he did pick up two of these. I picked up the Victor Allen's coffee. I did pick one of these up last week along with a mocha. I didn't care for the mocha very much because it just didn't have a very much flavor to it. But the peppermint mocha was pretty good. So I did purchase three of these today. And these come in the 9.5 ounce fluid ounce. And these are out of a company in Wisconsin. I also picked up the Pantry Essentials Traditional Pizza Sauce. It's made out of a company in California. I don't normally pick this one up, but I could not find the normal one, which is the Francesca Rinaldi Pizza Sauce. I couldn't find it at any of my Dollar Trees today. So I think I may have tried this one before. I can't remember, but this comes in the 14 ounce size. I got the pink lemonade Weilers light, and this comes in the 10 singles to go. And then I also picked up the Crush Strawberry, and that only has six packets. I have seen Linda from Linda's Thrifty Life. If you haven't checked out her channel, go check out her channel. You would absolutely love her but she's always getting brownie brittle. So today I finally spotted some in the store. I don't know if this is the one she's been getting, but it's the brownie brittle. It's in the two ounce and it's the lemon, Meyer lemon. It looks really delicious. And it says it's 130 calories per serving and it's a small bag. The next thing that I saw, I have never seen at Dollar Tree before, at any of my Dollar Trees. You can let me know in the comments below if they've had them in years before. But it's the Ellie Dinner Rolls. And it comes in the 10.5 ounce, and they're just a the little dinner rolls. So I thought I would give these a try. This mustard is from Chicago, Illinois. I haven't seen this in my Dollar Tree before. It's the brown spicy mustard, the glutens, and it is in the 12 ounce. So I thought we would give this a try as well. This is a repeat item. It is a two pouches of the pepperoni original 
Hormel. I have picked up a package of this Betty Crocker peanut butter cookie mix, simpler from scratch, and the 7.2 ounces. And I had not used it yet, so today I thought I'd get another because I don't think there's very much in here. It says it makes 12 cookies, so I thought I'd get the other one to make them both at the same time. I got a bag of the Fireside Mini Marshmallows. They're the 10.5 ounce, and I did get these to put on some sweet potato souffle for Thanksgiving. I picked up the Spice Supreme Chives. It's in the 1 fourth ounce. I also grabbed this Cinnamon Sugar Supreme Tradition. This is pretty heavy. It's in the 5.7 ounce. And I also picked up some parsley flakes and that is in the 0.49 ounce and I got the Russell Stouffer peppermint and it's a crushed peppermint pieces and white fudge that looked really yummy and it's the net weight 2.95 ounces but I just thought that looked really good and I picked up the chopped walnuts this is a repeat purchase haven't used them yet because i'm going to be using them for the holidays they come in the two ounces and it's by nature's garden and next i picked up the minced garlic supreme tradition and this comes in the eight ounce and i started using this maybe a month or a month and a half ago and i really do like this so i thought that's a pretty good deal and I just thought this looked very delicious. It's the Rudolph Red Nose Reindeer Official Licensed Product by Palmer. The snack mix. And it has the little reindeer and Santa and snowman inside. And it's got pretzels and peanuts. So this looks like a very good snack mix. So I saw that and wanted to give it a try. And then I also picked up the Rudolph by Palmer snack mix and it looks like it has the exact same things as this one I didn't pay any attention in the store so they're the exact same except one has Santa and one has the reindeer and next I picked up the Toastums pop-ups frosted strawberry comes six pop tarts and three packages and I also picked up the frosted blueberry my son found the dove men plus care it's the ultra hydra cream face hands and body i thought this was a good deal and will be nice for stocking stuffers or just to use for every day i picked up four of the sassy and chic shadow switching sponge this is the first time i've seen these at any of my stores and it is the sponge cleaning tool that easily removes color from eyeshadow brushes so they can be used to apply a new color so i thought these were a really good item to have and i opened mine up so i could show you what it looks like inside and then i'm just going to pull this out and show you it's kind of like a little sponge but it's a lot rougher than a sponge I thought these would make perfect stocking stuffers. I thought this would be a cute little gift to go along with other little snowman items that I picked up. It's an old Williamsburg hot cocoa and cream scented candle. It has a little candy cane and a snowman, and it is in the mason jar. I left out one of my food items. I bought this sweet relish in 11.5 ounces. I have bought one before and it was really good, but I don't think it was this one and it was a smaller and this is made in India and it says it is a green briar product. My son found this Disney Junior Launcher Flash Disc. It's by Disney Junior. It's Miles from Tomorrowland. Blast a buckle, ages three and up. And I did look this up online. And this is what I found online. 
and it retails for $12.69. And this is Disney at www.disneyjr.com. Tommy, and it's from Oak Brook, Illinois, USA. Next is a Turbo Wheels vehicle, Try Me Lights and Sound. And this is a Greenbrier product. And here's a little piece vehicle. And I just thought this was a really good deal for a dollar. And only one of the lights light up on it. Still, that's a good deal for a dollar. This is a huge Dollar Tree haul. So I'm going to let this be the last item for this video. And I'm going to do a part two. And you do not want to miss part two. So I found some awesome finds, some new finds. But this is a Christmas house solar decor. I only found this in one of my Dollar Trees. And I'm going to hang this outside on my patio. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this video. So look out for part two because you won't want to miss the things that I found. Thank you everyone for watching. And until next time, have an awesome day. Bye.